everybody welcome back to the channel again hope you and your family members are doing great today almost all these myths or conspiracies use truth to sell their lies by either over projecting the truth aspect or creating a false analogy for example we all know that garlic has some antibacterial elements however you must have already heard a ton of advice from the WhatsApp University to gargle your mouth with garlic water or consume large quantities of garlic is neither going to prevent nor cure coronavirus because two things COVID-19 is a virus and number two there is no scientific proof or research stating that garlic either prevents nor cures COVID-19 so you can see why even the highly educated people fall into this trap of believing those myths which makes it not so surprising that even genuine but ill-informed people such as your mom or your relative advise you to put a blow dryer in your mouth in order to kill the coronavirus so here are 20 myths and misinformations about coronavirus also known as COVID-19 which is a scientific abbreviation for coronavirus disease 2019. Spraying chlorine or alcohol on the body or drinking it in raw form kills the virus. Although hand sanitizers with alcoholic concentration of more than 70% can be used to disinfect surfaces that we use or wash our hands, it should not enter the body because these products will kill you faster than the virus once it enters your body and it's very detrimental even to spray large quantities of alcohol on your skin. COVID-19 is just like a common flu. Although coronavirus has flu-like symptoms such as fever, aches and cough, the death rate from seasonal flu is 0.1% whereas the current statistics show that the death rate from coronavirus is about 3% which is 30 times more. Antibiotics can kill virus. Again, antibiotics only kill bacteria. They do not kill viruses. You can protect yourself by gargling bleach. There is no circumstance under which gargling bleach can help you. Bleach is very corrosive and can cause serious damage. You have to be with someone for 10 minutes in order to catch the virus. The longer someone is with an infected person, the more likely they are to catch the virus. However, it is absolutely possible for you to catch the virus in less than 10 minutes. Hand dryers can kill the virus. No, they do not. In fact, wiping your hands with a clean handkerchief or a paper napkin are much more safer than a hand dryer at a public place because of the possibility of you contaminating your hand while removing it from the dryer because of the bacteria that exist on the surface. Thermal scanners can diagnose coronavirus. No, they do not. Thermal scanners can diagnose fever. However, other conditions such as common flu can also produce fever. Parcels from China can spread coronavirus. This is not possible because shipping boxes which are usually made up of cardboards on which the virus can last only up to 24 hours. If you want to know how long the virus lasts on various surfaces, you can either pause this video and watch the screen right here or else I have mentioned a link in the description which you can click on. A garlic protects or cures coronavirus. We already covered this in our video introduction. Everyone with COVID-19 dies. Absolutely not. Scientists concluded that 80.9% of the cases are mild which means that 80.9 percent of the people infected with this virus show mild symptoms or no symptoms at all thus not requiring any specialist treatments in the hospitals homemade remedies can cure or protect you against virus this involves a wide variety of measures such as sesame oil, garlic, vitamin C or sipping water every 15 minutes. Although regularly hydrating yourself is very good for your health in general, the proponents of this theory get so creative and formulate that by drinking water that drains the virus from your throat into your digestive system and then the digestive juices absolutely destroy the virus which is very creative but untrue because scientists recently found out traces of COVID-19 in the fecal matter and some other honorable mentions as we told before such as putting a blow dryer in your mouth are absolutely not true hashtag whatsapp university 
Hashtag fake news. You can catch coronavirus by eating Chinese food. <laughs> Laughable but sadly shared by certain groups who are either extremely ignorant or intentionally spewing hate against other minority groups. The virus will die off when temperatures rise in the spring. Although the medical community rejects this notion with extreme prejudice, until recently this was expressed by people in highest authority. Coronavirus is the deadliest virus known to the man. Absolutely not. There are so many other viruses which are much deadlier than the COVID-19. For example, Ebola or SARS. The virus originated in a laboratory inside China under the guidance of Chinese government. Well, despite many internet rumors, a recent study concluded that this virus is a result of natural evolution and not a man-made bioweapon. After examining its genomic data, if you're still not convinced by my answer and like to believe in the conspiracy theory, I inserted a link of that study in the description. And next, this is perhaps my favorite conspiracy theory, it can even be adopted into a movie. 5G network helps the spread of coronavirus. Some conspiracy theorists actually state that 5G is responsible for the rapid spread of coronavirus. And they state two reasons for this theory. Number one, a 2011 scientific study published in which scientists concluded that bacteria can communicate through electromagnetic waves. And two, Wuhan area is one of the first five cities to trial 5G in China. I actually even thought why wouldn't it be possible? But upon further digging, I realized that two things. COVID-19 again is not a bacteria, it's a virus. And number two, there are four other cities in China which implemented 5G but have low or no cases of COVID-19. And also the fact that cities or countries with no 5G infrastructure are still the epicenters of this COVID-19 outbreak such as Iran. And then there is hold your breath test. If you can hold your breath for 10 seconds but don't feel any pain or uneasiness in your chest, then you don't have corona. Please don't do this. Go to your doctor if you have any symptoms because this is what is most dangerous about misinformation. People who might have lived by approaching a physician's help would die by completely relying on this home-based diagnostic technique. Two and pneumonia vaccines protect against COVID-19. There are no existing vaccines for COVID-19 and even though you have immunized yourself before with pneumonia vaccine or just did it today, you can still be susceptible for COVID-19. COVID-19 only infects older people. Not true. Coronavirus can infect people of any age. However, older adults and individuals with pre-existing health conditions such as diabetes, asthma or pneumonia are more likely to become critically ill. Unfortunately, the younger people who do not show any symptoms or show mild symptoms are, are transmitting this disease, in fact killing many of the older people who are susceptible for this infection. And finally, rinsing your nose with saline protects you against coronavirus. Although nasal irrigation might reduce the symptoms of certain respiratory tract infections, scientists have clearly stated that this method does not reduce the risk of any viral infection. Remember that lowering the symptoms of certain disease is not the same as preventing the infection of another disease. As so much of information is being flooded each day, you can do two things. Try to trace the information back to its source. If you cannot do that or if the original source is shady it's probably not true or else you can always look for credible sources such as centers for disease control or world health organization finally let's end this video by appreciating the medical community the doctors nurses and all the staff who are risking their life each day to save us and just like our soldiers the debt we owe them as a society is eternal and unpayable Raj, I just heard that by smoking three cigarettes a day, you can effectively eliminate the virus because it chokes the COVID-19 in your throat. That sounds unbelievable, dude. Can you tell me who told you that? It's my uncle who's a chain smoker, you know.